What's up everybody, my name is Alan with Study Sound Audio and today I'm going to show you how to install our Axer GMP library in Decent Sampler. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go to decentsamples.com. Then you're going to go over to Decent Sampler plugin and download for free. Now here there's multiple versions. You're going to want to go into whatever's applicable to your computer, whether you're on Windows or Mac or Linux. I would just go with the full installer. And when you click that, you just enter your name and your email address. It's completely free. There's no hidden cost or anything like that. It supports VST, VST3, AAX, AU, all of that. Once you go ahead and grab that and you install it onto your computer, install it into your necessary folders for your plugins and whatnot. And then you're going to install the library. And how you do that, you go over to where you saved the library on your computer. It's going to be the Axer V104. Once you buy the library and you unzip it onto your computer, I recommend unzipping it to a external hard drive or something that has a lot of space, something that you're using for your audio files. It's very important that you do not move any of the files within this folder. If you do, it will cause a decent sampler to crash. Okay, so we have two presets, Guitar 1 and Guitar 2. Now you can load these as a standalone plug-in and it should load up. It'll take a second. Okay, so here it is in standalone. Now before you test the library, you're going to want to hit a key switch. And the key switches are going to be these red keys. If you don't hit a key switch first, it's going to play all the key switches at one time. So hit a key switch and that's sustain open. As you can see, everything works. It loaded up in standalone just fine. And please be sure to read your user manual before you install. This user manual has everything you need in it to get started, download, and everything about the plugin. There's also an important file in here that you'll need to read first. And any release notes for any version will be in this folder called release notes. Okay, so let's hop over to the DAW and get you going. I'm using Reaper. So I already have a track. And I'm going to go ahead and load up Decent Sampler for you. This is what Decent Sampler looks like before you load the library. So what you're going to want to do, there's multiple ways to do this. You can go to the file where you install the library and just drag a preset over into this empty field here. And once you do that, the plugin will load up just fine. Okay, and there's another way to do this. Okay, I'm just going to start over. Decent Sampler. Okay, you can go to File, Load, you can direct Decent Sampler directly to where it's installed on your computer. So we have G1 here, G2 for Guitar 1 and Guitar 2. So you just hit open. Wham, bam, you're ready to go. Remember to hit that key switch before you test it. And there you go. You're started, you're, you're ready to go. And if you want to load another preset, all you have to do is hit load, and then it'll bring you to that folder, and you just hit preset 2. And there you have it, preset 2. Everything works and you're ready to rock and roll. And also, very important note, if you're a Mac user or you use Pro Tools, Logic, or GarageBand, you're going to want to load Decent Sampler as a stereo plugin or a stereo insert. If you try to load Decent Sampler as a mono plugin and use our library, it will crash. Just a fair warning to all users. And that's how it's done. Now, if you're having any further issues, contact us at support at studysoundaudio.com.